In this video, I wanna take you through a core optimization action that you can complete for both your video and demand gen campaigns, especially if your demand gen campaigns are run around video ads. I do wanna make it really, really clear that video and demand gen are very much two different types of campaigns, but one thing they both have in common is that for success with either of these campaigns, you do need to make sure that you've got some really clear video messaging and videos that work. So that's what I really wanna focus on in this video. Let's jump into a screen share because what I wanna do is I just wanna really give you a bit of a behind the scenes look on how you can see success with your Google Ads campaigns. And especially as I said, for the video and demand gen campaigns. And this video is part of my Get Google Ready series, which is a video or a series that I release every year, which takes you through not only the core functions of how Google Ads works, how to set up each type of campaign, and then how to optimize those campaigns in the right way. I won't be going through and talking about anything with bidding when it comes to optimizations, because if you subscribe and watch this whole series, you will actually see that I will eventually release a full video on getting your bidding strategies right. For 2025. Let's jump into a screen share so I can walk you through this important process. If you want to get access to my full Google Ads optimization checklist, and this is a checklist which I've put together, which has all of the different optimization actions for search, shopping, performance max, display, demand gen, and video. We're going to really be focusing on demand gen and video. And what we're going to be focusing on is we're going to be focusing on our ads and really looking at the quality of our ads. The reason for why with both a demand gen and a video campaign that your ad quality becomes so important is because in these type of campaigns, because that you're seeing, you know, you're interrupting them when they're watching YouTube or various other places around the internet, you really need to make sure that you've got a high performance with your ads. So let's jump into a screen share so I can show you how this works and how you can get better performance. What we're looking at in here, now this is a video campaign. I will jump into a demand gen campaign, but firstly in the campaigns, we are in a video campaign. And if you go into the ad group, what I wanna show you in through here is that we're already up to four different types of videos that we've run. What I wanna show you in through here is that just by going through and doing different types of testing on trying to find what ads are working is that we've been able to drive these conversion rates up from up to through here, you know, 0%, 23, 32, 49. We still want to get this higher, but you can see this top one is getting cost per conversions at below $15. So we're looking at driving that up and we're running continuous testing. Now, the main metric that we really look at is this video play to metric. If you can't see it in here, go to columns. If you just do a search and just type in 25, you'll see video play played to 25% and select that. I've already got it in there because what we're really looking at through here, you can see through these bottom ads that we dropped out pretty quickly is the reason why we dropped them out is because when we were looking at this video play to rate is that, you know, even at the 25%, although this one was working okay, the 25%, but it just dropped out really, really quickly. These ads that are performing better, you know, we're getting them above the 10% at the end level. I would still like to get that higher, but that's the core metric that we look at. And we're continuing to go through and create different types of ads, really look looking at our hook, looking at what works, looking at what doesn't work. And what I also want to show you is if we go back to the campaign level from here, this was the main optimization action that we completed. And what I want to show you in through here is that very, very quickly, we were able to increase these conversions up from five a week, 20, 23, 33. It did drop back down again, but we were starting to build it back up. But just by pausing some of those ads, we we're then able to really focus in the spending on the best performing aspects of that campaign. So that's how it looks like in a video campaign. If we were to go over to a demand gen campaign, we're essentially going through the same process here. Again, is if you go through the columns, go to modify columns. And what we're um, looking at here, you can see with this one, with these, this is a different set of videos. You can see here that we had some high pickup rates at the start, but then it's just dropped off really, really quickly, which is why our conversion rates have been so low. So the first thing I really want you to get right with both your video or demand gen campaigns, before you put massive does amount of budget behind it, you wanna be going through and making sure you've got some really, really strong video messaging which is not only getting people to watch through to the end, but that you're also getting a high level of conversions. Now, ideally for me, I like to get the video watch to the end metric above 20 to 25%. Remembering there's gonna be some different factors there. You know, shorter ads, ultimately you're gonna get a higher watch rate. For longer ads, you might get a higher conversion rate, but a lower watch rate to the end. So that's where you need to balance things out. And what you wanna be doing with the video on demand gen campaigns is that when you do start to see those conversions come in and you get those conversions at the level or where you're happy with, you can then start to increase and scale the budgets for those campaigns. So that's a core action that I look at for optimizing your demand gen and your video campaigns. As I said, there are heaps of other op optimization actions that you can complete. So if you go to the description in the link below, 
You can download that checklist so you can start engaging all of those correct optimization actions for your demand gen and video campaigns. Once again, thank you for joining me. It's been an absolute pleasure having you here. And if you want to watch all of the videos in my Get Google Ready series for 2025, go through and watch this playlist right here. See you next time.